నమస్తే ఐ ఎమ్ పూర్ణిమ కార్పొరేట్ యోగా కన్సల్టెంట్ అండ్ యోగా ట్రైనర్ అండ్ డెమాన్స్ట్రేటర్ ఇన్ నేచర్ క్యూర్ హాస్పిటల్ హైదరాబాద్ టుడే విల్ బీ టాకింగ్ అబౌట్ ద ప్రాణాయామ్ ఇంపార్టెన్స్ ఆఫ్ బ్రీతింగ్ సో బేసికలీ వెన్ ఇట్ కమ్స్ టు బ్రీదింగ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ అన్ ఇన్వాలంటరీ ప్రాక్టీస్ వీ డూ నాట్ బ్రీత్ విత్ అవేర్నెస్ ఇట్ హ్యాపెన్స్ ఇన్ అన్ ఆటోమేటిక్ మేనర్ బట్ డిడ్ యూ నో దట్ మా మైండ్ అండ్ బ్రీదింగ్ ఆర్ ఇంటర్ రిలేటెడ్ so when we have to say control your thoughts and all initially the beginner practice is by focusing on your breathing now when you get angry or upset about something when you are feeling lot of anxiety your breathing is very rapid and also shallow chest breathing fast breathing but when you are in a peaceful state if you observe babies breathing or sleeping their abdominal movements are there and they are breathing in a very relaxed way so breathing and mind are interrelated in the sense when you want to control the mind control your thoughts you start with your practice of the breathing and checking your breathing is itself a very good practice for stress relief so initially place your one palm on your abdomen and one palm on your chest close your eyes and observe your breathing without altering or changing the pattern of your breathing so when you observe you can see whether your chest breathing is more or the abdominal movement is more whether your breathing is fast or slow deep or shallow whether your breathing is happening in a rhythmic manner or an erratic manner just witness without altering or changing the pattern and you will observe that if your breathing is fast or only shallow just breathing is only there that means you are not having enough oxygen intake in your body that will result in fatigue in the body and also instant tiredness and uh, uh, that will in- increase the stress in your body and the mind but when you are doing the deep breathing automatically your body is receiving enough oxygen plus you are also in a relaxed state because the mind is also calm that way so by improving our breathing itself 90% of our health diseases are resolved and by doing the wrong breathing practices we are inviting 90% of the health problems so how to breathe correctly we will focus on the abdominal breathing this abdominal breathing can be done also at night when you are sleeping in the lying down position also you can just place your one palm on the abdomen or simply closing your eyes witness your breathing inhaling feeling your abdomen bulge out and exhaling feeling your abdomen sink in so imagine a balloon when you fill the air in the balloon it bloats similarly our abdomen will bulge out as you breathe in and when you release the air from the balloon it shrinks similarly your abdomen sinks in as you breathe out so just closing your eyes in the supine posture when you take the deep breathing observing your abdominal movements that itself becomes a sort of meditation because excess thoughts or overthinking will not happen at that time because your focus will be on your breathing it is a dharana practice and moreover the deep breathing will help to bring more oxygen in the body and relax your whole body so just a very simple method of the breathing is the abdominal breathing placing your palm on your abdomen inhale slowly deeply feel your abdomen bulge out and exhale in the same pace feeling your abdomen gradually sink in again inhale slowly deeply feeling your abdomen bulge out breathe out and feel your abdomen gradually sink in so this method is a very good practice for stress relief and also prevents from overthinking and brings more oxygen to the body keeping your body and mind active and aware in a yogic way so follow this practice regularly and even in your work places you can now and then bring the awareness to the breathing and do these deep breathings to bring your mind to an aware state and also to relieve from the stress and fatigue of your work also thank you very much and have a great day